Hello and welcome back to Road Trippia, the once a day road trip trivia quiz. Today, day 126 of the 365 day trivia road trip. Today we have a pit stop trivia quiz. These are the quick trivias, okay? The questions are shorter. The answers come much faster. The name of the game today is speed. As soon as you know the answer, shout it out. Thank you for watching and good luck on today's quiz. Question number one, with the symbol PT, what is the transition metal found in a car's catalytic converter that is more expensive than gold when it is used in jewelry? The answer is platinum. Question number two, what is the 1690s event during which Giles Corey and John Proctor were executed for supposedly casting spells in a colonial Massachusetts town? The answer is the Salem Witchcraft Trials. Question number three, villains in Neverland include Captain Hook, and what other pirate? Hook's bosun and right-hand man. His name is Mr. Smee. Question number four, the art of stuffing, mounting, and preserving for exhibit the skins and bodies of deceased animals is commonly known as what? That is known as taxidermy. Question number five, sometimes called the Shrine of Democracy, Mount Rushmore is a South Dakota sculpture that was started by what sculptor who died in 1941 mid-project. His name was Gutzon Borglum. Question number six. This language, written from right to left, gave English words such as algebra, assassin, and coffee. What is this language in which the Quran is written? The answer is Arabic. Question number seven. It was supposed to land in Virginia, but storms on the North Atlantic blew it northward. What is this ship in which the pilgrims landed near Plymouth Rock? That was called the Mayflower. Question number eight. What Hans Christian Andersen fairy tale focuses on a character who is having a hard time sleeping due to an oddly placed vegetable? Which is the weirdest description I've ever heard of for describing this story. The answer is the princess and the pea. Question number nine. An earthquake may be detected by one of what devices that draws a line to represent the intensity of the quake? What's that device called? The answer is a seismograph. Question number 10. What Swahili phrase literally means there are no problems and was used in the song Off the Lion King? There are no problems or Hakuna Matata. Question number 11. 
question number 11. What name is given to the zone in a rainforest that is the topmost layer of tree branches and leaves that shades the understory? The answer is the canopy. Question number 12. Out of the 61 national parks in America, which one is the smallest at just over 5,500 acres? The answer is Hot Springs National Park. Question number 13. Which amendment to the U.S. Constitution lowered the voting age to 18 years old? The answer is the 26th Amendment. Question number 14. What is the name for the technology which emits waves with higher frequency than humans can hear that is often used to create images of fetuses in the womb? The answer is ultrasound. Question number 15. The three branches of the U.S. government have oversight of one another in a system commonly known by what three-word phrase? They keep an eye on each other through checks and balances. Question 16. The Magna Carta created the first modern form of what English governing body, which in modern times is made up of the House of Lord and the House of Commons? The answer is Parliament. The English Parliament. Question 17. Mesopotamia is Greek for the land between the rivers, specifically between the Euphrates and what other major Middle Eastern river? The answer is the Tigris River. Question number 18, because mega bats, or fruit bats, do not have to hunt, they lost the ability to perform what task that is closely related to sonar? They lost the ability to echolocate. Question 19. What British candy company and maker of delicious cream eggs was founded by a Quaker who could not attend university or join the military because of his religion? Last name's fine. The answer is Cadbury. Question number 20. What is the name of the striped character created by A.A. A. Milne, who is described as bigger because of his bounces? The answer is Tigger. All right, that is it for today. Thank you for watching today's episode of Road Trivia. Tomorrow we have one more pit stop trivia quiz before we move on to regular trivia on Monday. I'm coming back sometime this weekend. I'm pre-recording these still. I don't know what day I'll be back, so I just wanted to make sure I didn't miss a day. But uh, I should be back this weekend, so starting regular trivia on Monday. Here's question 21, the tiebreaker for today. Mel has 32 oranges and plans to keep one-fourth of them for herself and give away the rest. How many oranges does she give away?
She keeps one fourth. That's eight and gives away the rest. That's 24. The answer 24. Whichever player got closest and said it the fastest wins the point. Thank you for watching. See you tomorrow.